Hello there! In this video, we are going to learn all about personal pronouns. Before we start, take a look at these sentences. Kevin is a boy. Kevin likes to swim. Kevin won many swimming competitions. Hmm. Can you think of a way to make these sentences flow more naturally? We'll come back to this in a few minutes, but first, what's a personal pronoun? A personal pronoun replaces a noun or nouns in a sentence. There are two kinds of personal pronouns, subject and object. We're going to first focus on subject pronouns. I, you, he, she, it, we, they. A subject pronoun usually comes at the beginning of a sentence and does the action in the sentence. Abby bakes a carrot cake. In this sentence, Abby is the noun, or more specifically, a proper noun. What should we replace Abby with? Abby is a girl, so we're going to replace it with she. She bakes a carrot cake. What about this sentence? My brother likes to dance. We're going to replace my brother with a pronoun. My brother is a boy, so we'll replace it with he. He likes to dance. Let's look at the next sentence. Kimmy and I walk to school together. Let's replace Kimmy and I with a pronoun. What should we replace it with? Kimmy and I should be replaced with we. We walk to school together. Are you ready for the next one? The box is in front of the door. Which pronoun will you replace the box with? The box is a non-human object, so we'll replace the word with the pronoun it. It is in front of the door. What if there are multiple things or people like in this sentence? Caleb and Tiana built a snow fort. What should we replace Caleb and Tiana with? There's more than one person as a subject, so it's they. Good job. They built a snow fort. Then what about the pronoun I? We don't talk about ourselves by our first name, right? That would just be silly. My name's Chloe, but I don't say Chloe is hungry, Chloe wants dinner, Chloe wants a burger. Now, that's just silly. So which personal pronoun do we use instead? I. That's right. I am hungry. I want dinner. I want a burger. What about the pronoun you? When someone talks to you, it'd be strange for that person to say your name over and over again. So? That person will replace your name with the pronoun you. You are watching this video right now. Alright, let's go back to the paragraph you read at the beginning of this video. Kevin is a boy. Kevin likes to swim. Kevin won many swimming competitions. Hmm, how can we make these sentences flow more naturally using pronouns? We're going to replace all of the Kevins with pronouns, except for the first one, because we need to know who we're talking about. So here we go. Kevin is a boy. He likes to swim. He won many swimming competitions. Wow, that sounded so much more natural. Now let's focus on another type of personal pronouns. Object pronouns. Me, you, him, her, it, us, them. An object pronoun is the receiver of the action. Miss Re gave Zach a balloon. Who is the receiver of the action? 
Zach is. So let's go ahead and replace Zach with one of the object pronouns. Zach is a boy, so it's him. Miss Ree gave him a balloon. Shall we look at some more examples? I helped Nora plant a tree. Nora is a girl, so we're going to replace it with the pronoun her. That's right. I helped her plant a tree. What about this one? Can you tell your friends to come on Sunday? Let's replace your friends with a pronoun. Now friends means there's more than one. So which pronoun should we choose? That's right, them. Can you tell them to come on Sunday? Can you tell them to come on Sunday? Okay, here's the last one, you guys. More practice, the better, right? Mom took my sister and me to the hair salon. Can you replace my sister and me with a pronoun? Us is the correct answer. Good job. Mom took us to the hair salon. You did a fantastic job learning all about personal pronouns. I hope this video helped you better understand how to speak and write without using the same nouns over and over again. For extra practice, you can look at the description box below to find links to more videos, games, and activities. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this. Bye now!